This tutorial is about age transformation. We are taking an image, an image of a face, and we transform it to several ages. This, for example, transforming to a child and then to an adult from age of 10 until age of 80. You can see the, the result. Very nice. We are going to explain in this tutorial how to achieve this uh, outcome, this result, step by step. Now we are going to explain the, the setup process. Uh, of course, I'm going to leave a link at the video description uh, for the instructions as a text file so you can follow this process. Uh, first of all, uh, we are going to git clone this Python uh, library, it's called SAM, S-A-M. Then uh, we are going to create uh, a new Conda environment. Please notice the specific version 3.6.7. Next, uh, activating this uh, new environment. Now we're going to install the uh, PyTorch. Uh, first, we have to, to see our CUDA version. I have CUDA 11.4. The final uh, PyTorch uh, is uh, not good enough. We have to install 1.7.1. We are looking for the uh, relevant CUDA version and copy the command and starting the installation. This is a very uh, straightforward process. Next, uh, we are going to install several Python libraries. It's very important to write the correct version. Each uh, Python library has uh, its own uh, version. Please follow my uh, instruction file and you can watch this video or use the, the instruction text file. I will leave a link in the video description. As I said, it's very important uh, to choose the right version. Okay, the next step, we are going to download the weights file of the model. First, we are going to create a new di directory and uh, install another uh, Python library for download. And then uh, we will uh, copy this uh, command. I will leave it uh, on the instruction text file. Please notice it's uh, copying the, the a weight file to a folder that we created uh, earlier called pre-trained models and uh, we're going to use this file uh, later. Moreover, we are going to download next uh, another uh, weight file. Um, this is a, a weight file of a, a face model that uh, covers all the points in, uh, in a face. Um, this uh, Python library use this uh, file as well. 
Okay, this is the, the process. Process. It's called J Predictor 68 uh, phase. Okay, now we are going to choose several uh, faces and I'm going to, to create a new folder called the images and copy inside it our faces. And now we are going to, to run this uh, inferes uh, model. Uh, first argument is the, the result uh, directory. The second argument is the, the path for our weight file that we uh, download uh, previously. Okay. Next is the path for the images, our input images. And uh, then there are several arguments. Uh, you can copy it uh, um, as uh, it's shown here in the, in the video file. And of course, I will leave it uh, on the instruction file uh, as well. Please notice that there is another um, argument called target age. I wrote all the ages from 0 till uh, the age of 80. Now the model is start running. The model run uh, for each age and basically it will produce a new image that uh, in the result folder that we are going uh, to see in the end. Okay, the process is finished. Okay, we'll go to the results folder. We have two uh, folders. We're going to start with the inference uh, result. We chose the, eight, the age of 80 and you can see the, the result, the transformation. And this is where the, the input files, so we can compare one next to each other. You can watch the, the other folder uh, that uh, builds uh, one image of the input image and the result image, one next to each other for each of the ages. And that's it. Thank you very much. Bye bye.